What is up, Boss Nation? Your boy, On to the Boss, is back. And today, we got another great Ultimate Team episode. We have a lot to take care of, but first things first. Let's go ahead and start off the first gameplay of the episode yesterday. We got two games into one episode. And we're starting things off with an option play that went nowhere. And on fourth and five, he tries to go for it. His receiver cannot hang on to the ball. So Andrew Luck did not look good there on his first possession. We take over now. We are at our opponent's 20-yard line. And when you have a guy like Barry Sanders, you just got to keep on feeding him the ball. He went in for the first touchdown of the game. Just like that, we are up 7 to nothing. So we get to see Andrew Luck once again taking a shot deep. And I almost got mossed. Luckily, Vincent Jackson did not hang on. Once again, he's going for it on fourth down. This time, it got intercepted by Richard Sherman. So again, great field territory. We're going to go with a play action. Gronk feed the monster and he is just short We're at the one yard line a handoff to Barry Sanders I thought he was gonna get brought down but no Andrew Luck finally getting rid of it and the connection is made he is just short but without a problem he does end up scoring before the half ends so I'm looking at a minute left here we go to Antonio Brown the team of the year one broken tackle two broken tackles and man oh man if we broke the third I would have went crazy to end things off Russell Wilson scrambles out finds Sanders and just like that we score again before the half now things were Pretty interesting in the second half. He does end up scoring right here, and he takes the lead. So I'm looking at about 2 minutes and 15 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. We have to be clutch, man. With Russell Wilson right here, we cannot make any mistakes whatsoever. He's scrambling out. Ian Gronk. Gronk is there. Does a back juke. Gets tackled at the 7. We're at the 3-yard line now. A handoff to Barry Sanders. Nowhere to go. So big fourth and goal. You guys know what's coming. A quarterback draw. Just like that. We have now taken the lead. So all we need is a stop. Andrew Luck taking a shot deep once again. This time it is Harris Jr. to wrap things up. That is how the first game of the episode ends. I'm not going to lie, I was a little scared near the end. So when we got back to the main menu, I decided to go ahead and open up another Super Bowl bundle for you guys. I know it's not available right now, but at the time being, it was. So I recorded it, and here it is. Let's see what kind of cards that we are going to get. A gold badge and another Super Bowl coin up. This did not happen. If it did, your boy would have gotten 75,000 coins, but... It did not happen. We move forward. Now we're Red Flash. Robert Quinn. Now, I used to have Robert Quinn, but not anymore. So, I am going to go ahead and sell that because I don't really need him on my team right now. We move forward now. Another Super Bowl pack. A couple purple flashes. Three plus lead changes. This did happen. So, I'm going to get 25,000 coins. Let's go ahead and move forward. And we end off just getting Fred Jackson and the Super Bowl collectible, which... I already have it in a set, so I'm not going to be needing that. Moving forward. We start things off strong. Jamie Collins. That is like my third Jamie Collins. We get New England first penalty. They did not commit the first penalty, so that coin up goes to waste. And Geno Atkins. So that is now two elites in one pack. So this Super Bowl pack opening has been great so far for me. And now it is time for the final pack of the day. Purple Flash, Max Unger, 92 overall center, and not only do we get that, but we also get this right here, which did happen, that is 7,500 coins for me, and we end things off with Barry Church, so a lot of elites out of this bundle, which I am going to keep some and sell some, so now, with about 394 coins, after, you know, selling a few players here and there, I am going to go out and get this legend right here, Steve Smith Sr. Now, you guys see the stats. The thing that kind of blew me away was the 98 speed, 97 acceleration. I like speedy receivers. That is why I got them. And we're probably going to use them for a game or two. And then we'll go ahead and sell them and see who else we can bring in. I also decided to bring in a few backups. Middle linebacker, Terrell Suggs. Or should I say Patrick Willis. And then left outside linebacker, Terrell Suggs. Those guys are just for backup purposes. Just in case my linebackers get tired. Here's how my offense looks right now. Let's go ahead and take a look at my defense as well There you have it. It is now time to kick off 
game number two. So, the crowd is ready to go. Most of them are hype. Some of them are even doing the Gronk fist pump. Let's go ahead and jump into the two minute mark. Tom Brady runs a play action and he does connect with his receiver. On third and three, I'm controlling Richard Sherman. Give me that one handed user pick. That is a Super Bowl edition, Richard Sherman, and he came up big for me here. What an interception. Hand off to Barry Sanders. Barry gets tackled for about seven yards. We're going to go back to him on third down. He does get the first. This play is for Gronk. Wide open. No one is even ahead of him. The referee can't even outrun him. And he takes this one all the way to the nine yard line. To end things off, Russell Wilson goes back to Gronk, but we are just short. So we got two yards to score. And with Barry Sanders, man, this guy just fights for every yard. A touchdown once again to start things off. So let's see how Tom Brady's gonna respond on third down. Down he goes. So my opponent. Punted the ball. Here I am taking over, finding Odell Beckham. And I know what you guys are thinking. That is not the 97 Odell Beckham. That is the 94. A screenplay following that play. Bring out the red carpet. Barry Sanders untouched. I got the ball to start off the second half. And look at this run by Barry Sanders. His quickness. How did he even get by those defenders? I don't even know. What a rush. We went back to him here on the halfback draw. He fought for four yards. So now we're at the three. And the spotlight is on Steve Smith. The legend ends things off with a touchdown. So here's my opponent now. And he got a touchdown. So it is not over yet. But I feel like one more good drive and we can end things. We go back to Steve Smith right here. A nice game. First and 10, back to him, we are just short. Hand off now to Barry. Run up the middle, and there goes yet another first down. So we are now into the fourth quarter, and a few first downs can end it. Look at this pass to Steve Smith. And you know what? We're not done yet. Russell Wilson stepping all the way back and connects with Gronk and that is how the game ends a spectacular performance by Russell Wilson and Steve Smith again the 24 hour football honors the rookies of the year Aaron Donald and Odell Beckham are were impact for 24 hours it's gonna be interesting to see what players come up next it's your boy Anto the boss and I am signing out